Hi folks, this is Daily Spirit for Youth, a daily devotional that helps you grow closer to God and apply His Word to your life. Today's reading entitled, Between God and Prophet, written by Pastor Johannes Augusta Bambang Setiawan, is based on Psalm chapter 119 verses 33 to 40. I will read verse 36. Turn my heart to your decrees and not to selfish gain. Agit was just introduced to a viral trading app. The first time he tried it, he made four times the profit. He became more interested in the app and tried it a second, third, and fourth time and continued to make profits. From a capital of one million, his money has now become 50 million. Occasionally, Agit suffered losses, but the amount was small. After a month of trading on the app, Agit had made 200 million rupiah. His friends had warned him to be careful with the app. But feeling that Goddess Fortuna was on his side, Agit ignored his friends' warnings. Sure enough, in the second month, Agit suffered a huge loss. All the money he earned from trading just disappeared. Making a profit or a gain is everyone's dream in business. It is a natural thing. This is what the psalmist in today's reading felt. But the psalmist was wary of the desire for profit. He recognized that the desire for profit has the potential to distance one from God's commandments. For man can do anything to gain. This is where the psalmist reminds himself by asking God to turn his heart to God's decrees. Folks, we are all happy when our business and our work brings us profit. There's nothing wrong with making a profit. However, we need to be careful about the way we make profit. We must also have wisdom when we make a profit. Let us remember the message of the psalmist. We are told to set our hearts on God's decrees and laws. Remember not to focus on profit alone, but always on God. Ponder these questions. What is the psalmist's view on profit? How can you not justify any means for profit? Now let us pray. Dear Lord, teach us to keep you first amidst the need to make a profit. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If you feel blessed through this devotional, please share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to this channel to receive blessings every day. God bless you. Sahabat, mari dukung pelayanan dan pekabaran Injil melalui YKB. Dengan membagikan link acara ini kepada sebanyak mungkin orang Dukungan juga dapat saudara lakukan dengan mentransfer dukungan finansial ke rekening BCA Ke nomor 450-305-2990 450-305-2990 Atas nama Yayasan Komunikasi Bersama